Hi there, Hal McLean here, Geno's Homes Cold Roll Banker. We're standing out front here right now of Geno's newest show home for Sage Creek. It's a 2029 square foot bungalow with a fully finished walkout and a triple car garage as you can see. But let's go inside and have a look around and we'll show you around the house. And now inside, we're greeted by this beautifully large foyer, conveniently large at that and a beautiful double-sided fireplace here, separating the great room area from this large foyer. Off to my left here, we have, as you can see, some very beautiful eight-foot solid maple doors. Stain, of course, if you're building the house, is your choice. We also have the eight-foot doors here for the closet with a nice sliding one so they're not opening up into the foyer. On the other side of these eight-foot separating doors, we have two large bedrooms, complemented by a Jack and Jill bathroom, of which we're going to go and have a look at right now. This is becoming increasingly popular among, among the younger families, having the Jack and Jill bathroom, because this area here is private, this area here is up to whoever wants to use it at the time. And then we have another bedroom here, which is a beautifully large bedroom overlooking the water, gorgeous bright bedroom, coming back out into the hallway again here to the doors where we originally started. Now, we're on this side of the foyer, and double sided fireplace into a large, great room kitchen combo. Beautiful big windows overlooking the water with a huge deck that you can access from the door right here. And if you like to entertain at home or have dinner parties or entertain larger numbers of people, this kitchen works beautifully. You've got 15 feet of workspace here with a prep sink and an additional double sink over here. And of course you have a corner closet or pantry over here to keep everything that you would need. Okay, now we're in this beautifully spacious master bedroom. Beautiful featured wall here, beautifully bright looking out to the southwest. This is accompanied or complemented by a beautifully large ensuite. Actually, it's a little bit larger than the norm. So let's go in the ensuite here. Now we're in the ensuite. As you can see, dual vanity, quartz countertops, porcelain floors, frameless glass shower here, double sized with an unusually deep silver top and a very nice color scheme. Sound for when you're getting ready in the morning, control from here. Walk-in closet here for you ladies, beautifully designed. Can hang more things than you probably need to. Here we are in this beautiful entrance to the basement here. It's got its maple railing and glass with the stainless steel buckles. It's a very attractive entrance into the basement and it takes all the way down to our walk-in here. Now, in our fully finished lower level here with a structural wood floor for added comfort, and over here we have a walk-up bar with a granite countertop, sink, fridge. You could put a stove down here if need be. This is a granite countertop, all one cut. You could put some stools there if need be. And as mentioned before, if you like to entertain or have large family gatherings or whatever the situation may be, this basement is perfect. Look at the size of it. I mean, it's just beautiful in here. The spacious and brightness of it just takes me away every time. And of course, this lower level is finished off by this huge media room, theater room. This sort of sets the rest of this basement off. As you can see, it's beautifully spacious. We have room for lazy boy chairs here. You could make additional seating in here need be. And of course, it's all surround sound, nicely lit. The lights are controllable. We have the imitation curtain here to give it a theater effect. But as you can see, this area here is set up for entertaining. We have a pool table here that converts to a dining room table need be. Uh, the pool table could be anywhere in the basement that you want it to be. We just have it here for, for display purposes. If you walk up this way, we have an additional bathroom, which gives us three full baths for the house. We also have an additional bedroom down here. Last but not least, we have, of course, a walkout lower level here. With a beautiful stone patio here under the snow, unfortunately, we can't show you that. As you look out over the water here, it's a beautifully relaxing place to sit with a cup of coffee or even read a book or something.